Hi, I'm Laughing Woman, and I'm doing a reading so that we can take a look at the week ahead and plan how we're going to move through it. First card is Major Four, Strategy. The second card is One of Air, Inspiration. The third card is Achiever of Fire, Truth. The fourth card is Nurture of Water, Harmony. And the fifth card is Achiever of Water, Idealism. So, as we're planning to move through our week, it's clear that we need to create a strategy at the beginning of the week. So look ahead at what you need to get done this week or what you want to get done this week and make a plan and stick to your plan. Make that plan realistic. Don't make it overwhelming so that you've got an opportunity to actually succeed at fulfilling it. From strategy, we move into inspiration. Now this tells me that as we're laying our strategy for the week, we see some things that we really want to do. These may be new things that we want to add to our list. They may be ways that we know we can accomplish whatever we had on our list with greater ease or more fun or more creativity. Enjoy your inspiration. From there, in the middle of the week, we move into truth. And truth simply says that everything that's going on, everything that I'm saying and doing, aligns with every part of my being. I'm sitting in truth. Look for that in yourself. There's some places where you really know how to align with integrity and align with all that is sustainable as far as perspectives and actions and emotions. When you find that point where everything's really, really in balance with each other, you know that this is how your body experiences truth. Pay attention to that feeling in your body. You'll want to know it in the future. From truth, we move into harmony. Now, this is really a natural progression. When we know that we're seeing things clearly and experiencing things clearly, we have a tendency to be in harmony with ourselves and with the world around us because we understand how to be with it. Enjoy your harmony there and let the harmony move you into idealism at the end of the week. Idealism just indicates that you're seeing something in all of its perfection. Enjoy that. That's a wonderful vision to have. So in summary for the week, begin with a strategy. Don't move into this week just flying by the seat of your pants. Have a plan. Enjoy the inspiration that comes to you from laying that plan. And in the middle of the week, Pay attention to how your body and mind experience truth and remember what that feels like. From that place of truth, enjoy your harmony and step into your idealism toward the end of the week. Allow yourself to know that it really could be as perfect as you're seeing it. Have a wonderful week this week. Mm -hmm.